What's going on guys? So yesterday I came over to this canal behind me here and I fished this little trout magnet. 164th ounce jig head, one and a quarter inch soft plastic tail and it was too big for all the fish down here. There were a couple bigger ones but for the most part there were tons of like really really small ones going after the tail here and I just couldn't get them hooked. Now one of them hung on to the soft plastic for a little while and I was able to get a glimpse of it and it looked like a cichlid that's a little bit rarer than what I'm used to. It looked like a uh, Salvini cichlid. So we'll find out what it is today. At least that's the plan because I came prepared. I got the world's smallest hooks. Now I don't actually know if they're the world's smallest, but they're going to be by far the smallest that I've ever used. Hopefully it focuses well because that is how big they are. Like literally tiny, tiny hooks. I wish I could read what all this says, but they are small. We're going to be fishing some... Uh, live red worms on those. Now, whatever small fish are down there, they should have no problem getting hooked on these. So I'm gonna tie one of these on, I'll show you actually how small it is, and then we will get to fishing. All right, so there is the little piece of worm I'm gonna be using. I got a split shot right above it just to help with sinking because that thing is not gonna sink on its own. And a lot of the cichlids from yesterday, they were here toward the bottom along these rocks. So let's see if I can get one of those. Oh, fish on. What is this? Yeah, I was right. This is a Salvini cichlid, first fish of the day. Yeah, so this guy is super small, but take a look at that beauty. Perfect aquarium fish. Almost got away, but he is doing okay. So first one in the books, let's let this one go, and let's get into some more micros. All right, yeah, so just like I thought yesterday, it was a Salvini cichlid. Obviously, that little guy, I was gonna have an extremely hard time hooking him, even on that small trout magnet, but the Tanago hook paid off. Now let's get that worm back on down there, see if there's some more cichlids, maybe some different species. All right, let's drop this thing back on down there, right by these rocks, by this little canal wall bridge thingy. And there's gotta be another cichlid down there. And he got it. Oh, this is a bigger one. Oh, he came off. That was a bigger cichlid. Oh, fish on and off. fish on what do we got oh looks like a little baby bluegill all right so I thought all we were gonna get were little cichlids but I got my smallest bluegill ever so we'll let this one go and let's get back after those little cichlids alrighty back at it let's drop it along these rocks and let's see what else we get Fish on. Oh, that's a nicer one. That is a nicer Salvini cichlid. Look at this guy. All right, so look at this guy. Now, this guy probably could have hit the trout magnet yesterday. Biggest fish of the day. Not really micro fishing at this point, but this is about an adult, right? These guys don't get anywhere near as big as mine cichlids or jaguar cichlids, cichlids or Oscars. So they get a little bit bigger than this, but not by much. But beautiful fish. Really nice coloring on the belly, but we'll let it go, and let's see if we can get some other cichlids out of here. Alrighty, back on the drop. Oh, 
Oh, fish on. What do we got? What do we got? Another Salvini cichlid. This one's a little bit of a more dull and plain color. Alrighty, smallest Salvini cichlid, but Salvini cichlid nonetheless, number three for the day. Alright, let's keep dropping this down. There's got to be some other cichlids down there. Oh, there we go. Another little Salvini. Alrighty, another Salvini cichlid. Once again on the smaller side and duller in color. But these are like a really, really nice fish. I wish they got a little bit bigger. I wish I caught them more often. But beautiful aquarium quality cichlid. Fish on. This is a drop in real fishing. This one is a little bit nicer in color, but another really, really nice Salvini cichlid. All right, definitely one of the prettier, prettier Salvini cichlids we got today. Now, I mean, just aquarium quality fish. That's how these guys kind of ended up here. Someone released them from their aquarium decades ago, and now they're out here breeding, but just a beautiful, beautiful fish. So now I'm starting to wonder if there's some uh, other cichlids down there. So in this canal, I've caught mines before, and I've caught jaguars before. I just don't know if there's going to be any of these showing up here today. Fish on. Another bluegill. All right, one of the few native fish left in here. Tiny, tiny little bluegill. Another little cichlid. All right, lost track of how many of these I've got today, but five, six, seven, eight Salvini cichlids. All right, it's starting to get a little dark, so we can probably fish for a couple more minutes, and then I am going to get going. But so far, I'm happy with the way today went. Not a great variety, but we got a good amount of fish. Fish on. Another Salvini. All right, as if the cars weren't noisy enough, this guy's mowing the lawn. But another Salvini. So I've been fishing the outflow pipe. I think for the last couple minutes, I'm gonna head to the other side of this little bridge. I'm gonna fish the intake, and we'll see if there's any other species of cichlids uh, over on that side. All right, so here we are on the other side. Looks exactly the same, except the water is flowing under the bridge instead of coming out of the bridge like it was over on the other side. But still, we'll drop this little piece of red worm down. And let's see if we got some cichlids on this side as well. Uh oh, fish on. Looks like this side of the pipe is the same as the other, little Salvini cichlid. All right, yeah, other side of the pipe, more of the same, another little Salvini cichlid. And what do we got? Smallest fish of the day, that is for sure, but we got our smallest Salvini cichlid. All right, so that is going to do it. This little guy is our smallest fish of the day and our last, so we'll let this one go, and I will be right back with a 
quick wrap up. Alrighty, so that's gonna do it. Uh, all Salvini cichlids, almost. So I don't know, I got around 10 or so Salvini cichlids and two bluegill. Uh, these little hooks are awesome. So Tanago, they're Japanese. Don't know exactly what that means, but these are basically the smallest uh, hooks that you can find anywhere. They're not gonna come any smaller than this. So they were perfect for these little fish. And to be completely honest, um, they might have been a little bit too small. I had a couple fish almost get gut hooked, if you can believe that. But I am happy, so I figured out what these fish were yesterday. I thought they were Salvini cichlids, but they were too small for my trout magnet. Now, micro fishing, not for everyone. I enjoy it. I mean, some of the fish I caught today, especially one of those yellow ones, just beautiful, right? And you're never gonna be able to catch these little fish using traditional uh, equipment. So I enjoy it, it's something different. There was one guy that stopped by as I was catching one of these fish. He asked me what I was fishing for. I told him I was micro fishing going after these cichlids and he goes, oh, for what, for bait? And not a bad comment, just most people, I don't think understand the, uh, the joy or the excitement that you could have micro fishing. So if you've never done it, I think it's, it's pretty cool. I've done it a handful of times, something I wanna get into a little bit more, uh, but yeah. I'm happy, one hour well spent, the sun is setting, hope you guys liked it, and then I will see you next time.